heading in here to corporate mecca in just a moment big box heaven but first uh your prius gotta eat too so we're gonna make sure she's sipping good here we're getting some of that e87 saving pennies from exxon all right we're all gassed up prius has a full uh full belly and time to you know go fill our bellies as well at the kirkland food court uh -huh. kind of a big deal here at the local costco try to keep a low profile when i go in here you know no photos please All right, come along. Today I'm going to be walking you through Costco. Yes, Costco is a place that you may detest. Your personal version of hell is Costco on a Sunday afternoon. You came in for the frozen triple berry blend and peanut butter, but then you found yourself lured into the back corners of the Costco depths by the scent of the rotisserie chicken, and all of a sudden you find your cart full of a bold new light fixture for your kitchen, a lovely set of Pendleton mugs, pet insurance for your Labradoodle, and a casket. Yep, look it up. Costco legitimately sold caskets in the past. But Costco is my happy place. I'm going to be walking you through some of the items uh, that are great for runners at Costco. These are great for anybody on a fitness journey. But these are all things I've tried and have been on my shelf as I was training for the Boston Marathon this year okay so let's get moving i'm gonna head into the top corner of your screen uh oh but before we head in the top corner of your screen we're gonna do an outfit change what is it kirkland signature that's right this is a pima cotton t-shirt the quality is good okay send me off here we go boom real talk to get started during this marathon training block for boston i was having some gi distress while running not going to get into the gory details but these probiotic one a day vitamins have helped tremendously we're gonna leave it at that they've got 20 billion live probiotic cultures per pill in here but who's counting i hope no grad student is literally counting the numbers let's move on okay so yes turmeric is having a hot moment in the health and nutrition scene do your own research on the effectiveness uh, and its role in reducing inflammation for runners and other athletes some studies show that you should actually let your body Take care of its own inflammatory response instead of trying to tamp it down with some supplements. Draw your own conclusions, but if you're a turmeric girly, great idea to go with a Kirky Sig brand here. That's right, best value, and it does include black pepper in the pill, which is critical for the absorption of the pill. All right, speaking of pain and inflammation, I've got two great options for you today on that front for local pain, okay? One of them... Biofreeze. This is a roll-on stick. It has that wonderful icy hot feeling. I like to use this after runs particular uh, for things like lower back pain and calf pain. Primarily using this as a post-run tool. But what if you know you're going to be feeling some pain during the run? I've got a great solution for you if you're not familiar with it. Love to introduce you today to Voltaren. I use this pre-run. Yes, you're gonna see on the label here, this is marketed for those with arthritis. Yes, as runners, we are well on our way to being arthritic, uh, but this is a topical NSAID. This is something like a leave, but instead of popping a pill to take care of your entire cuerpo, you can just use this for only the spot that feels pain. So if you got something in your hip, lower back, calf, quad pain. This is a perfect solution. I first started buying this in Mexico years ago where they sell it in the little Mercaditos. They sell a 2% strength versus the 1% strength they offer here in the U.S. at Costco. Okay, we're still on the health and nutrition game at Costco. I'm going to introduce you to Calm. If you have not met, the, met Calm yet, this is a magnesium supplement. This is well documented for helping with muscle relaxation and soreness, especially after big workouts. This can help fight off the dreaded DOMS, delayed onset muscle soreness, baby, if you don't know, now you know. This has documented benefits for helping alleviate cramps. So if you're a big cramper, maybe it's time to tamper down with some Calm, okay? Warning alert, warning dose up slowly with calm because this does also act as a stool softener. Yikes! Okay, this tub has 142 servings, so we got a lot of servings of calm in here. 
20 bucks on sale at Costco right now. This goes a long ways, but the value is so good. A 50 serving tub online right now through Amazon is going for $20. So you're getting three times that amount for the same price. All right, moving on. Another great supplement that's having a real hot moment right now, collagen peptides, well known also for helping with muscle repair and recovery. So obviously great for runners. Various flavors here I've never tried before, like lemon. Whoa, I've only tried the chocolate flavor. I put this in my coffee in the morning, a little scoop, which actually is really fantastic. Uh, makes my fingernails grow twice as fast, which is also wonderful. Um, serious note here, I did read a piece in the Bureau for Investigative Journalism that this brand of collagen peptides, um, which is extracted from the skin of cattle, icky, it's been linked directly to pretty significant Brazilian rainforest deforestation and violence against indigenous people in the Amazon. Yikes. I'll legitimately be thinking twice about uh, before I buy this product again. Okay, protein. Don't need to tell you all about the importance of protein for building muscles, recovery for runners. So I put one big scoop of this protein uh, from on in my smoothie after a workout. This adds 24 grams of protein for just one scoop. Remember, you do need carbs and protein to recover well. So that's why it's really important to add things like berries and other carb sources to your smoothie. Um, or just have a piece of toast with your smoothie and milk uh, after you run, okay? This is spendy, yes, over 60 bucks, but this is an 80 serving bag. This is the same price as 50 serving tub online at GNC. Plus, I usually wait to buy this one online until it goes on sale, which happens at least once or twice a year. So wait, get that sale, save them bucks. Uh, there's other ways to recover other than just whey protein. Whey protein. So one of my favorite best recovery on the go drinks is chocolate milk. Really embrace your inner child here. This has long been touted as one of the best recovery drinks because it has a wonderful blend of carbs and protein together in there. This Dairy Gold 18 pack of chocolate milk for $12 is a no brainer. Such premium value. That's the Kirkland signature way, baby. Okay, one of these tubs, or sorry, one of these uh, single drinks of chocolate milk at the store is $3. You're getting 18 for $12. It's wild. And who doesn't look forward to a nice cold chocolate milk after a run? Let's stay on the liquid train here. Let's talk about energy drinks, okay? This is real talk. You know, they got a little bit of a taboo. You see your skateboarders in the skate park with their monster energy drinks. You don't see too many uh, spindly runners out there crushing energy drinks and Red Bulls. But maybe we should see some more of them because caffeine has long been known to be a legal performance enhancing drug and I am a big caffeine consumer for that very reason. I like to keep my corpus rolling around at optimal efficiency. It's going to take a lot more than just a 35 milligram caffeinated gel to get me buzzing and that's where Celsius comes in. Celsius energy drinks pack a whopping 200 milligrams of caffeine per can. Not necessarily recommended for those that don't have any caffeine intake or tolerance, but if you do have some tolerance, like me, try drinking one of these 30 minutes before a workout. I had one before Boston, about 30 minutes out, and had a significant and noticeable difference. The ever popular Liquid IV, best branding ever, I love that name. These puppies are not cheap, but it's so easy just to throw one of these little baggies in your workout bag, mix it up in your water, water bottle before or after a run. I like to use one of these sticks over two liters of water, so just half a stick per liter, as uh, each stick does go a long ways. They're about a dollar a stick at Costco versus $150 a stick at Target. There's a couple varieties here. My favorite is the green tea one. Uh, I like to use this in the morning before a workout as it actually is caffeinated. And you've already heard about my affinity slash addiction for caffeine. Keep the energy up. All right, let's move into the food category. We're going to start with a staple in the house. This is the Nature's Valley Fig bars. These are quick and easy carbs to get in uh, before a run. If I'm running in the morning before work, I eat one of these packs, 200 calories in the tank quickly, mostly carbs, you're good to go. Most of all, the value of these is just ridiculous. 40 cents per pack at Costco right now versus 70 cents a pack at Target. 
Flavors at Costco are blueberry and raspberry, 38 grams of carbs. That's almost two gels you're getting. So these are a no-brainer for someone looking for a quick, tasty snack. Drink them with a cup of coffee. You're going to love it. Okay, next is Go Go Squeeze. If you're an adult runner out there that likes the same food as your children, this might be a fit for you. Go Go Squeeze applesauces come in these convenient little packs, around 16 grams of carbs per pack. It's a touch less than a gel. People like these in the ultra running community as it's a welcome consistency change from gels. I've used them minimally. Uh, they're undeniably tasty, but they're a bit heavier, quite a bit bulkier than gels, uh, so not the most convenient to carry, but you know, a nice way to mix it up. All right, we're talking about food, things gonna fuel you during the run. Let's get to some real talk because straight up candy is legitimately an option. I'll be quick to point out that candy is not created equally to all gels. Gels have specifically dialed in glucose, glucose and fructose ratios. They've added branched carbon amino acids, electrolytes, and other things that are going to keep you operating at your best. But there's certainly a place for good, old, quality American candy in the mix here, especially if you're balling on a budget. You just need some quick carbs before a run, or your stomach can't take one more freaking chocolate gel. Rice Krispies might be the trick for you. Gels these days are typically ranging from about $2 up to $4 for a single Martin gel. I'm trying to eat about three gels per hour when I'm running, so that adds up quickly. Rice Krispies at Costco right now are only 23 cents per pack, and they're conveniently packaged. They only have a few less calories and carbs than your standard gel, and they're just undeniably tasty. I mean, chocolate drizzle flavor. Let's go. Here we go. All right, let's move on to the house and home as there are a few quality items here at Costco that can bring some quality benefits to any runner's life. First up is the Winex Air Purifier. Okay, first of all, if there is such a thing as a stylish or handsome air purifier, this one is probably it. It's got clean lines, baby. Price is $130, but I've seen this one go on sale for 20% off routinely. This includes extra filters, it's Bluetooth connectable through your phone. So if you're living in any type of Rockies wildfire environment or wherever else is getting wildfires these, day, these days, this one is a no-brainer so you're not sucking in smoke all night and undoing your hard training. On to the massage guns. Okay, most of us have seen these being used as a recovery tool over the past few years now. Theragun started a great thing years ago, but now the competition has brought some quality competitors at much better prices. This Sharper Image massage gun is a great example at Costco. It's a quality tool, she's got all the attachments, and it might lack just a touch of the power of a Theragun, but it's going to do the job for about 95% of people out there. I like to blast the calves and the high booty area consistently after runs, and that keeps me out of the PT for those $120 appointments. So this gun has paid itself off quickly. Uh, there's even this little mini version that's a great tool for those traveling to races. And for 50 bucks, this is a phenomenal value. If you don't have one, take yourself down to Costco and get it. Okay, so you've finished your long run for the week. Sunday run day in the books. You sweaty. You muddy, you're going to hop back in that Prius and transfer all that stink onto your nice car seats? Nope. These $30 seat covers from Costco provide that premium barrier between your farty butt and that nice seat. Maybe you didn't quite make it to the bathroom in your interval workout at the track and you've got a muddy buddy situation going on down below. But no prob, this seat cover has you covered, my friend. Wiper blades, completely non-related running item here. This is just a general PSA. If you're at Costco and you see the Michelin wiper blades are on, stay, on sale, it's time to stock up. It's such a good value. You cannot find a quality wiper blade for twice this price at AutoZone. Fun fact, I once wore the official Michelin man suit at Old Faithful in Yellowstone National Park. Not joking. All right, we're moving into the great outdoors. Got a couple of great running related great outdoors items for our runners out there. Let's start with bear spray. This is a huge necessity for those of us living in bear country. We need to be responsible in bear country. Running with bear spray is the best way to do it. And the value at Costco is too good to pass up. Two of these for 45 bucks. 
That's 50% savings from what we're seeing Barry Sprague listed for in most outdoor stores. Okay, I have admittedly never bought or used the water port go spout before, but color me intrigued. This is a portable pressurized water supply system that can function as a shower for camping or spraying down a runner on a hot marathon or ultra marathon course. The quality looks super good, so if you've been in the market for something like this, this might be your guy. I think you would literally have runners bowing to you on an 80 degree marathon course if you filled this with ice water and sprayed those puppies down. All right, our last item for today, sunscreen. No one likes melanoma. So we got lots of options from Costco. Here is a great value on some Neutrogena sunscreen for those of us that can't quite swing the super goop price tag. Wear the sunscreen and you will look like this forever. Congratulations, you've just embarked on a grand treasure hunt at Costco, it's time to treat yourself to America's best deal. This is the $1.50 Costco hot dog and soda. I knew I was a Costco ride or die when last year the founder of Costco said that he would, quote, kill the CEO if he ever raised the price of the Kirkland Signature $1.50 hot dog and soda. That's a great day at Costco. <laughs> If you are on the Costco executive leadership team and you are watching this video, please sponsor me. I'd love to kick off the Kirkland Signature Elite Racing Team. Large and in charge. Let's bring it. Get in touch. If you are liking this content, be sure to smash that like button. And apparently there's a little bell you can flick as well to make sure you get notifications when my new videos come out. To all my Kirkland kings and Kirkland queens out there, thanks for tuning in. Have a great week. We'll see you next time.